Presented by Listen Headlines. Latest financial news from trusted sources. Forex Live. July 30, 17. 42 America New York. Forex Live America's FX News Wrap. Core PCE comes in weaker but Amazon earnings, COVID worries dominate trader mindset. Forex News for North American Traders on July 30, 2021. That key data came in better than expected with YOY inflation at 3.5% versus 3.7% expected. The monthly increase came in at 0.4% versus 0.6% expected. Few. Forex Live. July 30, 1726 America New York, August Forex Seasonals, The Danger Zone. August seasonals highlight the risks July was a volatile month where a bid in bonds eventually spooked the broader markets. Seasonally, August is a time to be worried about risk trades, with some of the strongest seasonal trends in the Forex market. New York Times Business, July 30, 1724 America New York, Bezos Company loses challenge to NASA SpaceX lunar lander contract. The Government Accountability Office set a $2.9 billion award to SpaceX to build the next lunar lander for astronauts would stand. An artist's impression of NASA's Artemis mission on the moon. BBC News Business. July 30, 1650 America New York, Monzo Bank in Money Laundering Rules Investigation. Monzo warned investors that the investigation could have a negative impact on the digital bank. Wall Street Journal U.S. Business. July 30, 16, 29 America New York, a no-jerks policy ignited morale at the company behind Yankee Candle. When Ravi Salagram took over Newell Brands, employees told him of a toxic workplace culture. If they pushed back on something, they would get fired on the spot. Wall Street Journal U.S. Business. July 30, 1617 America New York, Biden to tap artificial intelligence expert as top business diplomat. Stanford professor Ramin Talowi as the president's pick for assistant secretary of state for business, a White House official said. The Library of Economics and Liberty. July 30, 1616 America New York, a modest proposal for earmarking. Earmarking, congressional funding of specific local projects, arranged by individual lawmakers with little scrutiny from their colleagues, is undergoing a reputational rehabilitation. Forex Live. July 30, 16. 14 America New York, major indices close lower led by Amazon and concerns about COVID variant. Stocks close near session lows hurting the indices and market today was Amazon which fell minus 7.5% or minus $269.94 after revenue shortfall and expectations towards lower revenue growth ahead. Forex Live. July 30, 1601 America New York. U.S. Jobs Report next week highlights the week's key events and releases. ISM Data and Jobs Reports highlight the events next week Monday will be the August 2nd and the start of a new month. That means the traditional ISM data, ADP employment, the U.S. and Canada jobs reports. Marginal Revolution. July 30, 1543 America New York. Our regulatory state is still, still, still failing us. The U.S. agency leading the fight against COVID-19 gave up a crucial surveillance tool tracking the effectiveness of vaccines just as a troublesome new variant of the virus was emerging. Daily FX Market News. July 30, 1526 America New York, Bitcoin, BTC, USD, forecast, big levels to determine Bitcoin's fate? Bitcoin, BTC, prices fall back to $39,000 after failing to hold above the critical level of $40,000. New York Times Business. July 30, 1518 America New York, Guggenheim Museum curators moved to join a union. The curators, as well as conservators and other staff, are looking to join a local of the United Auto Workers. Conservators, curators and other staff members at the Guggenheim Museum in New York are seeking to join a union local affiliated with the United Auto Workers. Forex Live. July 30, 1513 America New York. Bitcoin heads into the weekend trading with the price staying just below its 100-day MA. 100-day MA at 40,162.95 The price of Bitcoin is heading toward the weekend trading with the price hanging just below its 100-day MA. That MA currently comes in at $40,162.95.
A move above that level going forward would look to the June 15 high at $41,341.57. Above that, and traders will look toward the Forex Live. July 30, 1447 America New York, WTI crude oil futures settle at $73.95. Up 33 cents or 0.46% on the day for the week, the price closed a week ago at $72.06. The week's gain is $1.89 or 2.06%. Looking at the hourly chart below, the pair dipped below its 100-hour MA on Tuesday only to quickly rebound. Wall Street Journal U.S. Business. July 30, 1435 America New York, Bezos Blue Origin rebuffed in contract protest. A federal agency upheld the decision to make Elon Musk SpaceX the sole winner of a contract to develop a moon lander for NASA. Forex Live, July 30, 1433 America New York, MUFG Trade of the Week, Sell Your, GBP. Trade for the coming week Mitsubishi UFG suggests selling Your, GBP in its weekly FX pick. The pair suggests selling it from spot at 0.8520 with a target of 0.8350 and a stop at 0.8670. Wall Street Journal Markets, July 30th, 14. 32 America New York, investors rethink China bets after Beijing crackdown triggers stock route. The widening regulatory crackdown by Beijing wiped some $400 billion off the value of U.S. listed Chinese companies this month. Dot. Wall Street Journal U.S. Business. July 30, 1428 America New York, Scarlett Johansson's agent rips Disney over Black Widow dispute. Creative Artists Agency has stepped into the fight between Scarlett Johansson and Walt Disney over financial fallout from the streaming release of Black Widow, accusing the studio of attacking her character. Wall Street Journal Markets, July 30, 1419 America New York, stress tests show European banks would survive another severe recession. The results pave the way for EU-based banks to resume paying dividends after a ban on them when the pandemic started. Marginal Revolution July 30, 1408 America New York, the Great Psychometric Test continues. Australia has deployed hundreds of soldiers to Sydney to help enforce a COVID lockdown. A Delta outbreak which began in June has produced nearly 3,000 infections and led to nine deaths. Google Business News. July 30, 1400 America New York. Letter. Bradford Salon Owner Thankful for Small Business Grant. Bradford Today. Letter. Bradford Salon Owner Thankful for Small Business Grant Bradford Today Wall Street Journal Markets July 30, 1352 America New York, Robinhood stock sale soured by investor confusion. The trading platform's commitment to democratizing the IPO process may have played a role in the offering's big initial stumble Thursday. Forex Live July 30, 1347 America New York, gold fails at the July high, forming double top. Gold spins its wheels again the $1,834 resistance level and some moderate US dollar buying today spelled trouble for gold today, even with yields dipping another 3 bits per second today. New York Times Business, July 30, 13, 42 America New York, vaccinated people may spread the virus, though rarely, CDC reports. The proof is an outbreak in Provincetown, Mass., the agency said. But unpublished internal documents paint an even more harrowing picture. A dose of the Pfizer-BioNTech vaccine being administered at a three-day clinic in Wilmington, Calif., on Thursday. Wall Street Journal Markets, July 30, 1340 America New York, Exxon can't catch a break. ExxonMobil posted strong results as oil demand and prices bounced back. Questions regarding long-term strategy still cloud its valuation. Forex Live, July 30. 1256 America New York, U.S. $1 trillion infrastructure package gets enough votes up for debate to open. A step forward in the $1 trillion infrastructure package The bipartisan $1 trillion infrastructure package has received enough votes up for debate to open in the U.S. Senate. Forex Live, July 30, 1253 America New York, NZDUSD returns to hourly MA levels today. 100 200 hour MAs in play the NZDUSD has moved lower today and in the process returned back toward the 100 200 hour MAs.
yesterday, the price trended higher and reached the 61.8% of the July trading range at 0.70188. Sellers leaned against the area. New York Times Business. July 30, 12, 29 America New York, Spanish court targets Chilean bank tied to Pinochet. Spurred by victims of General Augusto Pinochet's regime, the court has reopened an investigation into whether Banco de Chile helped the former Chilean dictator launder money, General.